just want to kind of touch on it for foundation so I can have something to spring off from. Take your time. Bro. In Ephesians 4th chapter, I want to pick up right from verse 18. Nah. Having the understanding darkened, being alienated from the life of God through the ignorance that is in them because of the blindness of their heart. Now, any time you disobey God, you become spiritually <coughs> blind. Mm -hmm. Disobedience, unbelief, creates a spiritual blindness. In other words, you cannot follow God if you can't see God. Now, when we speak about seeing God, we're speaking about the manifestation of God that is created through His living Word. Yes. The Word comes, uh, becomes alive in each and every true believer. Yes, Lord. But church, as I shared last Wednesday, I believe, is to everybody, but it's not for everybody. Amen. Yes. Jesus said, He that believeth yes. and is baptized, the same shall be saved. So, uh, this Christian walk, contrary to what they teach over television and all these mega preachers, it's not, it's not for everybody. You can repeat all you want, uh, Romans 10th chapter, and you ain't going nowhere when that trumpet sound, with the lake of fire. Unless your life is proven by the spirit of obedience, you can never be accepted in the kingdom of heaven. Amen. Now again, we want to be tried. I said, the enemy is attacking through the family structure. Primarily, the teenagers. Have I not told you that the sodomites and the lesbians are after the teenagers? Amen. Now they're in, in cooperation with government. Yeah. When you put government and the sodomite lesbian coalition together, you got a powerful force. And you need God to intervene. God cannot intervene where there is strife and disunity. Yes. This is why we've got to stay together. Because we have to pray together. Let not any type of dislike come within the sisterhood. Amen. Sisterhood is the foundation of the New Testament church. Yeah, that's right. Now, we, we've got to be together. And, and, and daughters, let me tell you all something. Yes. The enemy will try every trick in the world to put one against the other. Sure yes. Don't go for it. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. If you see one with a negative spirit, ease yourself out the way yes. and pray for him. Don't get angry. Yes. And say, oh, there's a devil in that. No, don't do that. <laughs> ease away and Amen. wait for a better day, Amen. a better moment, Amen. a better time. But keep praying. For that one. And while you're doing it, pray for yourself. That's right. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Don't, don't, don't throw the stone and hide the hand. Right. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Praise God. Teach. Right. All right. All right. So here, <laughs> we want to understand here that through the blindness of their faith, they became disobedient and could not fulfill the instruction God had for his people. Yes. Now I want you to pick up in verse uh, 19. Who being past feeling have given themselves over unto lasciviousness to work all uncleanness with greediness. All uncleanness, which means sinful life, yes. sinful behavior, with greediness or, or hurry up and do it. Yes. Uh, 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 glad to do it. We'll do it abundantly. Uh, the more they discourage, the more they discourage this one, they want to discourage somebody else. The more misery they create over here, the more misery they want to create over here. But within the household of faith, we can't have that happen. Yeah. 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 We've got to be determined and we've got to be a, we've got to practice psychology. Yeah. Understand that everybody's personality is not the same. Everybody's demeanor is not the same. So when you see a person who is going through something, Sometimes it's good to put your arm around and say, Hallelujah. Daughter, I know you're going through something, but I want you to know I'm praying for you. Amen. Amen. Call me if you need me. Yeah. That's right. That's right, Papa. Don't have an alienated yes. affection toward them because that multiplies the problem and puts a weight on you. Yes. Because now you become a part of that sin yes. because you're going along with it. Uh -huh. Don't go along with it in that context. Be there for them in a supportive role. And understand, you too sometimes yeah. might have 
a little weight on you. All right. It might not be smiley and lovey-dovey all the time. <laughs> Amen. So let's learn how to pick up each other and bear one another's burden so that all of us together can be in the same harmony and the same spirit. And watch that devil. Yes. Watch him get knocked down every time he raises his ugly head. And we're together in the unity of one Amen. spirit in prayer. Watch that devil get yes, knocked down. Yes, yes. We can do it yes. if we want to. Yes. But we have to first want to. And first of all, you got to be the word of God. Yes. If you don't be the Bible, everything else don't mean a cent. Not one cent. But you got to believe this. The attack will come on a personal level. I've told y'all that before. But if you keep hold of God, he said he would not put on you more than you could bear. He means that. Yes. And God loves you so much that he died for you. Yes. If you can understand that. If you can understand Calvary. Amen. If you understand the sacrifice that he made was personal, it was for you. Yes. While you was yet in sin. Bible said God loved you. Yes. Now what he means, he didn't mean he loved your lifestyle. But he loved your inner soul. Yes. And this is why he died and gave you instruction so that you could follow him in spirit and in truth. Again, now we're in Ephesians 4 chapter. Uh, I want you to read verse 19 and 20 together. Who being past feeling have given themselves over unto lasciviousness to work all uncleanness with greediness, but ye have not so learned Christ. You never learn strife, anger, jealousy from God. That's right. It's not recorded in the scripture for the believers. Read. If so be that ye have heard him and have been taught by him. Been taught by him. By the word. By the yes. Bible. Uh -huh. As the truth is in Jesus, <coughs> that ye put off concerning the former conversation. Uh, that, that former life yes. where you was ready to knock somebody down because <laughs> they said something you didn't like. Right. That's gone. Amen. 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 You can't retaliate. Amen. Even, listen. Amen. Even in subtle form. Because subtlety don't mean nothing inside of God. He already saw your thought from right. Yes. So don't try to use subtlety to try to get back at someone Amen. who might have offended you the day before yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> that don't work today. Amen. God already sees the intent of your heart. So let's not even go in that direction. Yes. Hear me. Yes. Amen. Let's be straightforward yes. and for real in our character. Because God knows the character of the individual. He knows the inner soul. He knows your inner thinking. Yeah. So let's be for real. If you want to get a prayer through, you've got to be for real. Yes. Hallelujah. All right. Let's not be like the world. Yes. world is an enemy of God. Amen. Yes. We are God's chosen people. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And you, you see the manifestation of his power. Look what we are doing. Amen. Yes. Amen. Nothing. Hallelujah. Come on. Y'all you know we're getting ready to, since we're here, we're getting ready to buy another house. Lord. Amen. Amen. Three bedrooms. Amen. Big bedrooms. Amen. How they do. Nice house, nice neighborhood. Right. If God wants to have it, we're going to have it. Amen. Now we're stepping out on faith. Amen. I'm trying to show you what we can do. And this is for the kingdom. This is for us. These houses, these properties are for us. Yes. That's right. You can't get evicted. Yes. Unless God puts you out. Yes. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes. Ain't no such thing as back note. Yes. Yes. Catching up on your note. Uh uh. Ain't no such thing as that. Yes. If you can't pay glory, yes. we pray to God and come when you will be able to give a donation. Yes. Yes. Donation. Yes. Not no obligation. You ain't signing no lease. Praise God. Can you understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Things are really going to get bad financially. Yes. Don't worry, worry about what you see over television about the stock market going up. That's for the banks who are exchanging in this money market, this mad international money market. That ain't for working class people. If it was, how come working class people ain't getting $15 now? That's right. <laughs> Why not? It's fair. God said workman is worthy of his, of his labor. Yes. Why not? Amen. Because people at the top would rather see homosexual bills and legislation put forward rather than a $15 minimum wage that's fair for everybody. Yeah. Yeah. So we have to take care of ourselves through instructions 
and the blessings